Patient is caused by brain injuries, head injuries, strokes and bleeds. The first year I was I was totally uh, uh, aphasia. I w couldn't understand you, and I couldn't actually speak to you. You know, and then it's improving over time. You know, my, my speech is a bit better, my writing is a bit better, and my reading is very good. You know, so you know, but it's you know it's four years since I got a stroke. So you know. Um, so it's very hard to understand who, you know, who I came from, you know, because they, they knew before me, you know, the, the, the pre-stroke, you know, I was a fit fella and um, I would take my um, son to train, I would train them, hurling and football and all that, you know, and then Got a stroke. Um, well, it's on oh my. Um, I can't do. I can't do um, more than when I. I can't write on my name. Um, I can't got. Um, I don't know A B C or D at the start, and that's like having a baby starting. It's skip. Um. And that's very very hard. It's that's it's this my life or my lo at this life or my life that I'm starting, looking them looking having like having a baby. For the very 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 and that is very very hard, very hard. My writing is gone, but I'm improving. And my writing is gone, but I'm improving, and my re reading is gone but in improving oh it's a very hard to, uh, i can't it's very annoyed in my but get annoyed if i want to say something and i can't I want to come well and that's very 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 annoyed very annoyed i lost my voice for about a year you know and i didn't understand you you either anyone that spoke to me i didn't understand half an hour <sighs> I mean, no, that's it. Yeah. Finished for the day. Uh, I, I, I didn't, I didn't know. Uh, uh, I, I, I knew what was going on around me. And uh, I, I, I could understand everyone talking to me. But I, I couldn't communicate with them. I didn't, I, I didn't, uh, I couldn't get the words out and it, 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 made, it made me, it made me, it made me so aggressive and, and then also it made me, it made me sort of shut down because where, 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 when I couldn't, uh, when I couldn't speak to anyone and they didn't understand me, I, I saw that, I just saw the kept, kept it all to myself until until uh, I, I could learn to speak, and you know, I I I I could, I, I, I know, uh, I I I practice, I practice my speech, without any any anyone being there, so that when someone came in, I knew know exactly what I want to say to them. Well, for me, I didn't you know? understand anything for about a year. Yeah. But then, um, um, my wife, and the speech and language person got to me and it kept going and going and going and going and I eventually got my speech back a little bit you know yeah. a little bit you yeah. know and so, how did it feel when you woke up and you couldn't understand or you couldn't speak um I was worried you know because I didn't know what was going on you know I would I you know um for example my job was an accountant 
and I couldn't understand it, you know, yeah. what was on and, uh, you know, and, you know, and um, say my football team, I couldn't understand it, you know, or the hurling team, I couldn't understand it, you know, what I'm talking about, you know, so, so, um, it was a worrying time for me, you know, yeah. that, what to be one year or 18 months, you know, yeah. but I got out of it, you know, with, with speech and you know, all, and and with writing, um, it, it it it's a bit back, and reading is fairly back, you know. Yeah. So you know, it's very good. Like um, in the hospital, and uh, like uh, my job gone, and mm -hmm. uh, in job in Africa, and business here gone. So, oh fucking hell, <laughs> just, and, um, and then I go to the, to the shop, you know, and uh, the papers, I, I couldn't understand for the headlines, yeah. anyway, um, okay, so, Okay, <laughs> you have to go. So um, you have to go up and go off about it, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah. yeah. But not um, like like um, my speech gone, but my memory was perfect. Well, like I said, it was very, uh, very hard for the last couple of months. So because I can't uh, say my name, I can't do that. Um, a like a a b c d. That's very that I'm trying to do it to myself. That's very hard. Um, if I want to say something, but it's very hard. Oh, it it. It wants to come out, but it won't come out there. Mm. I mean, I was there, mm. but it won't come out there. Mm. And they're very, very annoyed. That does get annoyed. Yeah. Very annoyed. And it gets very, very uh, angry. Angry. You get annoyed. So you want to say, and you can't. Mm. And that's very, very, very hard. Yeah. Very hard. Hello, I'm William Walsh. Um, I got a stroke. Um, I remember on the day I, did, I was in the house on my own. I didn't feel well, so I went out and got a taxi to, to um, uh, uh, second, uh, Ellen Park, Ellen Park. I, I just remember the, the fray, uh, uh, what do you call it, the, the, the trias, or trias or whatever it is, sitting there, and next thing I, I didn't know what happened. The next one I, I was, I didn't know where am I, I was, where am I, where am I, Who, who's everybody, who's, who's everything. I couldn't read. I couldn't read or write. What is happening to me? He said. And I, I was, I was panicking. I was panicking that at this time, <laughs> took me a long time to get uh, to just get me ahead around that. And then I said, right. And then I started. Well. I can walk, I said. I can go to the toilet myself. So I said, there's an awful lot of people worse than I am, I said. And then I went down to Dunleary. And um, I, I saw that my kids, I have three kids, and um, they thought, 
they like kids kids were told that that Anne that Anne is my mother or that's my spouse, my spouse. Um told the kids that that I have had a stroke, can't read or write, and be patient. And then eventually I went back to Vincent's for a year and a bit and I said, you can go now, he said, to the nurses. I remember that at the time it was lashing rain, I had no money, I said I had to walk, I knew exactly where I had to walk. That took me a long time. In the, in the meantime, I had uh, Anne and and myself had re, 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 re set we were going the other way. There was no uh, animosity, no animosity. Um, so uh, eventually, I got uh, I went down, and then I I got a a care. A carer. They wouldn't let me without the care of uh, Vincent's until I got a carer. And I met and I, I saw a couple of, couple of people and then I, I met a great friend, mate of mine who is a great mate of mine now as a carer. And he does, every, does everything for me as well as a mate and all that. And I walked and he, we got a flat. In Rock uh, uh, Rapines, in Grandma, in Grandma. And that, I'm, that's very close close to my own house. Was. And, uh, and I go to flat, and I, said, I have that, and I love it, and I'm grand, grand now. And that's, you know, but, so I've, I've, I've gotten very happy now.